I gotta put my strap on. Pause. What's good, YouTube? It's your boy John Ken. I can't talk too loud. I got the I got the little mic on, you feel me? A lot of y'all from the TikTok wanted some YouTube content. A lot of y'all from the YouTube wanted some more YouTube content. I am today we're going on a uh trip my favorite rocket ship. Now nah, we're going on a grocery haul. We're gonna show y'all how to spend a hundred dollars for a week of meal prep food. Most of it. It's 2023. I don't know how possible this is. But we're gonna make it happen. So a lot of people have been asking me for the YouTube content. And when I say a lot, I mean a lot, all right? So this is what we got going today. A lot of y'all, you know, the, the, the winter's coming up. I don't even know why y'all so into fitness, man. I'm different now. Shit's way different now, okay? I don't, I don't do all this super duper cut stuff throughout the year. I like to I like to stay at a certain weight, but because so many people want the content, because I get so many followers and new people on uh, TikTok every day, the lives are jumping. I'm, I'm incorporating more workout stuff, so I figured I start pumping out like a video a day. Now, for those of y'all who knew me from like when I used to make videos all the time, and it's not gonna be that high quality of stuff. All right, this is just content. I know people just want content. So it's gonna be some real raw, real deal, real easy stuff to watch. But I wanna help y'all out in y'all fitness goals and then we are gonna get more into like men's health and I'm even gonna throw some gaming in, but I'm gonna be live when we do that. All right, y'all. So first off, it will behoove you to have an Aldi in your city. If you don't, I don't know what to tell you really. Not a bars. I be spitting. Go to Aldi. You gotta give up the brands, bro. You gotta you gotta give up the 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 Target, Walmart, all that. If you try and shop on a budget, you gotta you know what I'm saying. You gotta shop on a budget. Now, usually for me, I don't shop like this. I just get what I get. You know what I'm saying. Sell my soul at the register. See if they'll take my firstborn's arm, and uh, we keep it pushing. Am I zoomed in? Back up off me. I, I gotta put my strap on. Pause! My firearm. Find an Aldi in your area. Alright, this is the cheapest grocery store you're gonna you're gonna find from here to Tim Buck too. First thing you do is figure out how to get your quarter in there deep enough to get your basket. First order of business in the store is protein. That's what's gonna cost you the most. And that's what you need the most. You to have some self-control. Walk past all the bread. I know you don't want to, but you got to. The snack aisle in Aldi, everything in here costs 50 cents. <laughs> everything in here costs 50 cents. Just keep your eyes straight. You have to think about how much protein you eat a day. I drink 75 grams of protein a day. All right, I drink 75 grams of protein. So I eat 125 grams of protein. Break it down like that when you start getting into cost. Look at this. You see that? There's one and a half, one and a half pounds in there. Then you gotta break down how much protein is in a pound. As a rule of thumb, there's about 80 grams of protein per pound of chicken thigh. I love chicken thigh, we trying to keep this cheap. Let's see how much chicken thigh that's gonna take. It's gonna be about 10 or 11 pounds of chicken thigh. But we're not gonna buy that much because there's protein in other shit. When it comes to the chicken thigh, make sure that there's about two pounds per pack. I got three packs. It's $2.99 a pound, so this is $6.50, $6.607, all right? And right there, how many pounds we got? Yeah, we got six pounds. Now, I don't wanna just be eating chicken thigh. I could, I, I could get some ground turkey. That's 93.7. Again, I'm not trying to get super lean. I'm looking, they usually have some turkey burgers. I think they're all out, Jesus Christ. Let's do some, just to keep the variety high, let's do some 90-10, two pounds of 90-10 ground beef. That's all the protein we need for the week. Psych, I lied. They got pork tenderloin. This pork tenderloin is $5.69. And in this pack, this is about four pounds. 
it sure doesn't feel like it's four pounds, but it's a dollar fifty a pound. It's about four pounds, so and and pork tenderloin is the macros are excellent. Three grams of fat per four ounces, three grams of fat, twenty-one grams of protein, and one gram of carb. So matter of fact, I'm gonna grab two of those. Yo. So I got me a loaf of bread. This is an Italian loaf. This is three dollars and nine cents. I got some flour tortillas. This is like less than $3 or something crazy. Here we are here. Now, these are $1.19. And this right here, you can eat this for convenience. This isn't, this isn't always the cheapest option, but it's definitely an excellent option. I'm gonna go ahead and grab about four of these. Uh, probably gonna grab five. Three of the roasted chicken. To it a long grain wow we cannot forget about breakfast turkey bacon they're three dollars and 49 cents each that's seven bucks right there we racking it up now aldi has the best eggs dollar 21 no i gotta get two dozen oh my god they didn't pick through these eggs like a lord jesus Two dozen of these, what we at? <laughs> I don't even know the run in total, but I trust in Aldi so much. But I think I'm gonna just keep grabbing stuff. Okay, and last but not least, I'm trying to stay out of everybody's way. We are gonna mess with some of these potatoes. 2.29 per bag. And potatoes are so versatile. So we like to grab three bags of those. Y'all, Aldi got self-checkout now. So I can record it. Let's see what we got. I'm gonna add the bags into the total and everything. They're 12 cent a pop, let's see. One, two, three, I think I'll need four. I love this, self-checkout? $12.48, terrible start. $6.07, that brings our total to $18.55. Okay, another one, $24.50, protein bag. 3108 46.77 41.85 I was a little under I said the protein cost 40 okay. now this is some stuff I didn't show y'all I got some chickpea rotini oh I didn't scan that last bag hold on gotta scan the bags gotta scan the bags they gonna say I was stealing boom boom totals at 46.12 4740 4859 4978 All right, we broke the $50 mark. We halfway home and I know for a fact that we going to make it. This bread costs 3.99, Jesus. I also got this. This is some pasta sauce for that pasta. $1.49. One. 299 229 2 3 got some onions too I couldn't record everything y'all Those are 229 as well And I got some little mini bell peppers Somebody who watched the videos came in and said hey to me It's funny when I had that little part-time job People who are younger generally like self-checkout. When I worked at a place with self-checkout, and the older crowd would always, always, always choose to have a person check their groceries. And honestly, I think that's a problem because they are more used to human interaction. When I tell my wife all the time, like I think we've become fully socially awkward because anytime you can elect to get away from a human at this point, we do. All right, all right. So the total came to 82.80. We made it. The budget was 100. No, no, I got it. All right, y'all, I just recorded this. I got to re-record it. 
because I didn't have my mic on, man. So let's go ahead and go through this, these groceries. Um, I had this at the house, which is why I didn't buy it at the store. Let's just say this adds $4 onto that $86 bill. This is now $90, okay? Um, this is for breakfast. So let's go ahead and break down the, the carbs first. Whole loaf of bread. We got, boom, 90 second rice for Monday through Friday. I know a lot of people don't like to cook before work. And I know you don't like to eat old rice, so it's really good to just pop this in the microwave before you leave. Okay, this chickpea rotini pasta, high protein pasta, I want. There's a very specific way you have to cook this, so y'all be on the lookout, right, for it. But per serving, there's 51 carbs four and a half grams of fat and 19 grams of protein, which is why I say you don't always have to get your protein from your meat. There's gonna be some things like this. And throughout your day, there's little things like a pack of uh, oatmeal has four grams of protein. Two slices of bread has five grams of protein. Um, one pack of rice, a whole pack of rice has 10 grams of protein. You can easily squeeze out an extra 25 grams of protein if you're eating the right, you know, accessory foods with your protein. Potatoes are always really versatile. You could chop them up, make some house fries in the morning. You know what I'm saying? Like some hash brown type deals in the morning. It's, it can always go, you know, beef beef and potatoes you can always do that this right here i'm gonna tell you exactly why i got this there's meal prep videos coming i just want to explain a few of them to y'all we're gonna saute some of these saute some onions right pan sear some chicken thigh and just bust that down with some rice that as a meal with some good seasonings always works out you feel what I'm saying to you? Obviously, we got the bananas for whenever I need a banana. This is always good to have with different protein sources to just, you can always throw different protein sources in a wrap, chop up some veggies, throw it in a wrap, you know, hot protein source, like a, like a little cold cut, you feel me? Nothing too crazy, but it's, it's always good to have. Um, turkey bacon for the breakfast. The, let's look at the macros. Two and a half grams of fat, two grams of protein, no carbs. This is just something to taste good, right? You want bacon, but you can't have it, so you get some turkey bacon. You feel what I'm saying to you? <laughs> 22 slices in here. You could just eat it up in the morning with some eggs. The eggs are $1.21 per dozen. Eat, eat, eat a couple eggs every morning. That's just, that's just easy work right there. Um, then we got the pork tenderloins, three grams of fat. 21 grams of protein, one carb per serving, and the carb is probably from the seasonings they put on there. Obviously, we got the 90-10 ground beef. Gotta have some ground beef, gotta have some red meat, and I tried to keep this cheap. I usually get steak, but we're gonna eat this up this week with the roasted garlic and the chickpea joint. That right there had you farting. Now, high fiber, one. And then, obviously, we got the three packs of chicken thigh. There's meal prep videos coming for all these ingredients. Y'all boys, stay tuned. Oh, I gotta do the outro. <laughs> Stay right there, don't go nowhere. At the end of the day, all y'all need to do is remember three things and you're gonna be okay. That's if you train good, eat good, and sleep good, then that's a good ass life.